Are you looking for ways to keep your furry friends safe and healthy? As pet owners, we know how important it is to keep our pets happy and thriving. That's why we've created this channel to share tips and tricks on how to care for your pets, from preventing antifreeze poisoning to keeping them safe during the winter months. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on the latest pet care information and join our community of pet lovers. Thank you for tuning in, and let's get started. Now, we're going to talk about antifreeze and why it's dangerous for pets. First, let's start with what antifreeze is. Antifreeze is a liquid that's added to a vehicle's engine cooling system to help prevent the engine from freezing in cold temperatures. It's also used to prevent the engine from overheating in hot temperatures. Now, why is antifreeze dangerous for pets? Antifreeze contains a chemical called ethylene glycol, which is highly toxic to animals. In fact, just a small amount of antifreeze can be deadly to a pet. When a pet ingests antifreeze, the ethylene glycol can cause severe damage to their kidneys, liver, and brain. Symptoms of antifreeze poisoning in pets can include vomiting, diarrhea, lethargy, loss of appetite, seizures, and even death. Unfortunately, antifreeze has a sweet taste that can be attractive to pets, which is why it's important to store antifreeze in a secure location where pets can't access it. If you suspect that your pet has ingested antifreeze, it's important to seek veterinary care right away. Now, we're going to talk about the symptoms of antifreeze poisoning in pets. Antifreeze is a liquid that contains a chemical called ethylene glycol, which is highly toxic to animals. Unfortunately, pets are often attracted to the sweet taste of antifreeze, and even a small amount of it can be deadly. The symptoms of antifreeze poisoning in pets can vary depending on the amount of antifreeze they've ingested and how long it's been since they've ingested it. However, there are a few common symptoms to look out for. One of the first symptoms of antifreeze poisoning in pets is vomiting. Pets may also experience diarrhea, loss of appetite, and lethargy. As the poisoning progresses, pets may become more disoriented, start to tremble or seizure, and show signs of difficulty walking or standing. Additionally, pets may experience an increased heart rate and rapid breathing. As the poisoning becomes more severe, pets may start to show signs of kidney damage. These symptoms can include decreased urination, increased thirst, and anorexia. If left untreated, antifreeze poisoning can lead to acute kidney failure, which can be fatal. If you suspect that your pet has ingested antifreeze, it's important to seek veterinary care immediately. The earlier the poisoning is treated, the better the chance your pet has of recovery. Here are a few tips on how to prevent antifreeze poisoning in pets. Store antifreeze out of reach. The best way to prevent antifreeze poisoning is to store it in a secure location that's out of reach of pets. This could be in a locked cabinet or on a high shelf. Check for leaks. Make sure to regularly check your car for any antifreeze leaks. If you do find a leak, make sure to clean it up right away. Dispose of antifreeze properly. When disposing of antifreeze, make sure to follow your local regulations. In many areas, it's illegal to pour antifreeze down the drain or on the ground. Instead, Take it to a hazardous waste disposal facility or an auto shop that accepts used antifreeze. Consider a pet-friendly alternative. If you're worried about the risks of antifreeze, consider using a pet-friendly alternative. There are several brands of antifreeze on the market that are made with propylene glycol instead of ethylene glycol, which is much less toxic to animals. Keep an eye on your pets. Finally, make sure to keep an eye on your pets when they're outside. If you see them sniffing around a puddle, it could be antifreeze. Make sure to clean up any spills or leaks you see right away. Aside from antifreeze, there are other winter hazards that pets can face. These include exposure to the cold, slippery surfaces, and toxic chemicals. Let's take a closer look at each of these hazards, exposure to the cold. Just like humans, pets can suffer from hypothermia and frostbite if they're exposed to the cold for too long. Small and thin-coated dogs, as well as senior pets, are particularly vulnerable. Here are some signs of hypothermia and frostbite. Shivering, lethargy, weakness, pale or blue gums, skin that feels cold to the touch, discolored, swollen, or painful paws. To keep your pet safe from the cold, make sure they have a warm and dry place to rest, 
and limit their time outside in extreme temperatures. You can also consider using pet clothing or booties to help keep them warm. Slippery surfaces. Winter weather can create slippery surfaces, which can be dangerous for pets. Dogs, in particular, are at risk of slipping and injuring themselves. To prevent slips and falls, consider using pet-friendly ice melt on your sidewalks and driveways. You can also purchase booties for your pet to provide better traction. Toxic chemicals. In addition to antifreeze, there are other toxic chemicals that pets may be exposed to during the winter. For example, many people use rat poison and other pesticides to control rodents during the winter months. These chemicals can be deadly if ingested by pets. Make sure to store these chemicals in a secure location where pets can't access them. Now, we're going to talk about how to keep pets safe during the winter. Winter can be a challenging time for pets, with cold temperatures, icy conditions, and potential hazards like antifreeze. Here are a few tips on how to keep your pets safe and healthy during the winter months. Limit time outdoors. Pets are susceptible to cold weather just like humans, so limit their time outside during extreme temperatures. If your pet must go outside, make sure they have access to shelter and warmth, and consider using a jacket or sweater to keep them warm. Check paws and ears. Pets can suffer from frostbite or injury from walking on ice and snow. Make sure to regularly check their paws for signs of damage, and wipe their paws and ears clean after being outside to remove any salt or ice melt chemicals. Keep them away from antifreeze. As we mentioned earlier, antifreeze is highly toxic to pets. Make sure to store it out of reach and check your car for leaks. Consider using a pet-friendly antifreeze alternative. Provide plenty of water. Pets need access to fresh water at all times, even during the winter. Make sure their water dish doesn't freeze over and refill it often. Don't leave pets in a car. Just like in the summer, pets should never be left alone in a car during the winter. Cars can quickly become cold, and pets can suffer from hypothermia. Watch for signs of illness. Pets are more susceptible to illness during the winter months, so keep an eye out for any signs of illness like coughing, sneezing, or lethargy. If you suspect your pet is sick, make sure to take them to the vet right away. What to do if your pet is exposed to a winter hazard? If your pet is exposed to a winter hazard, such as antifreeze or another toxic chemical, seek veterinary care immediately. The sooner your pet receives treatment, the better their chances of survival. In the meantime, here are some things you can do to help. Remove your pet from the source. If you suspect that your pet has been exposed to a winter hazard, remove them from the source immediately. For example, if you suspect that your pet has ingested antifreeze, move them away from the area where the antifreeze is located. Call your veterinarian right away to let them know what's happened. They may be able to advise you on what to do next and can prepare for your pet's arrival. Follow your veterinarian's instructions. Your veterinarian will provide you with instructions on how to proceed. They may advise you to induce vomiting, but only if it's safe to do so, or to bring your pet in for immediate treatment. Monitor your pet's symptoms. Keep an eye on your pet's symptoms and report any changes to your veterinarian. Be sure to follow any instructions for home care, such as administering medication or providing supportive care. Thank you for joining us today to learn about the dangers of antifreeze and other winter hazards for pets. By being aware of these hazards and taking steps to prevent them, you can help keep your furry friends safe during the winter months. Remember to store toxic chemicals in a secure location, limit your pet's exposure to the cold, and seek veterinary care immediately if you suspect that your pet has been exposed to a winter hazard. Stay safe, and stay warm.